Yeah, so I uh, recently uh, was looking into, um, I guess it's like the subject matter of geology and the um, layers of sedimentary rock, which a lot of people, uh, people that believe in evolution or people that don't believe in God, they think that these layers were laid down very slowly, like one little layer at a time, very thin layer over millions and millions and billions of years. But to my surprise um, and amazement, and uh, you know, it totally points to God, is the rock layers actually indicate very fast um, process of being laid down. Um, if you study the sedimentary rock layers, um, they are very thick and they're very pronounced and distinguished one from another. Like say we have like, I don't know all the layers, but we have like sandstone in one layer and then there's like a chalk layer and then there's like a rocky layer and and then right on the very top is the soil layer. And the reason, and they spread the, I think it's like the entire globe has all these layers and they're very thick. And, and they basically match up all across the entire globe as well. And the reason being is, and see, like the layers, it's like all these different layers. It's not like a little bit of this and a little bit of that. It's like, this is the layer of sandstone. And then this is the layer of, of uh, chalk. And this is the layer of well, some other type of layer, right? So the reason behind that is because of the flood, when God flooded the earth and the process of water, um, water, if you were to go to um, like a uh, creek or a river and you look at how the water um, pushes the like debris it kind of has a sorting process and it basically is sorted um in accordance with like density and size of the material so the kind of like all the this um sediment is all mixing around in this giant flood and then it gets laid down layer upon layer depending on um, its density and size. So that's why you get these like giant layers of a certain type of rock or mineral or a granule of uh, sand or whatever. It gets deposited layer upon layer upon layer upon layer in a sorting, a very clean cut, very sorted way that water, um, that water does. Um, so, and that can be observed and there's no erosion between layers. It's, um, basically very clean cut, very pronounced types of layers and they're layer upon layer, very thick that spans the entire globe. And, um, so that is total evidence of the flood during the days of Noah, when the people were very wicked upon the earth and God was grieved that he created mankind, but Noah found favor and uh, God instructed him to build the, the ark, the boat, so he could survive the flood along with seven other people of his family. And the rest of the people were wiped out. And then, um, yeah, that's how the sedimentary rock layers were laid down very quickly, very rapidly during the flood. And people um, don't see it that way. They get these different ideas in their mind. But if you take a look yourself and you examine these layers and you can see, especially if God's with you, you'll be able to see like, wow, that is actually what happened. That is what we see in the rock layers is actually indicating uh, the flood and very fast, rapid,
deposit of these layers all across the globe. And so it's not an indication of layer upon layer of little tiny layers laid down over millions and millions of years. It indicates very fast. Um, and there's other parts all in that, like um, finding trees in the layers, like standing up and there's this great big column that's a tree right in this layer upon layer you know and um and the folding of the layers you know and it's really something to look into and i thought it was really fascinating and really amazing and it's really something that people get it in their mind that it means something else or they think it indicates something else and they're just deceived and they got this stronghold in their mind and they go about teaching it in school and all this stuff meanwhile they got it all wrong and 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 what the evidence isn't indicating what they think it indicates so i just wanted to share that with you and and have you even look into yourself into it yourself and, and be amazed um what actually the rock layers are indication of is the flood um as recorded in the bible so i just want you to know that and god bless you and jesus name i love you